Hello everyone and welcome to the stream. I am Razim. And I just realized I forgot to actually transfer or blah 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 One moment. There we go. <laughs> and this is Monster Hunter World. Once it loads. Looks like it got home it, it looks like it got home just in time then. What is with the Irish accent today? I don't know, I'm kinda tired. I was up early this morning and literally just got back in the door. Oh, okay. Yeah. Spent the day looking at lions and tigers. Oh my. And bears, oh my. Oh no, there were no bears. There were no bears. There were meerkats, though. And lemurs. Then you can't do the oh my because there weren't bears. It's lions and I tigers and bears, bears, oh my. So what you're saying is that the lack of them makes their whole sentence unbearable? It makes it null and void. What is with... People in the UK and their stupid puns. Have you ever been here? No. The state of this country, the state of the country, it's all we have left. <laughs> it's a big joke. Oh, and the dragon on the flag of one country in the UK. That's also good. It's okay, uh, Aizen. I got a particular... I think we have enough data on the Rotten Vale now. Oh, shut up, Navi! God, I hate her. We all hate her. If only Pickle actually got her. That would be the dream come true. I, I can't reverse that, so... Uh, you'll just have to enjoy my nope sticker. My nope thrower. You just noped yourself. Oh crap, I did. <laughs> so, for the record, the, one of the reasons I'm actually a bit tired is that... When I left the house on Friday, I was about to hit 50,000 meters on my walking progress on Pokemon Go, and I'm currently set at 58.1 kilometers, so yeah, quite a bit. That sounds like a lot of work. Well, most of it was today we were walking around a zoo. It does take a lot of walking. Oh god damn it, Navi! I will shoot you out of a freaking cannon! For extra damage. Sure. Okay. Kissed is the posted. Ah, oh, Dot. No, I am not. Which one are we hunting now? I have no idea. Oh, it's our good friend Teostra. Ah. I had so much fun with him and his uh, girlfriend wow. last that week. Is a lot of... That is a lot of what? Fire? I have no idea. He well, I'm, I will join you once I've eaten a meal. Oh! I need more slicing ammo. 
And sticky ammo. And my palicos of well, my tail of a raider goat group have returned. I should probably see what they've got for me. Hey, the limited bounties this year are easy. Uh, this week. <laughs> this year? Oh yeah, I wish it were. Uh, I'm glad it's not a yearly thing, that would suck. That would. Um, the limited bounties, we're going to get progress on them from this quest, because it is... Slay five Elder Dragons, complete four quests in the Wildspire Wastes, and hunt that fish that happens to be in the uh, Wildspire Wastes. Which Turn one's off? that? That's the one, yes. Hey, I made Sticky Ammo 3. Where is it? It got stuck to the crafting machine. I will shoot you out of a cannon. Is it at least a fun cannon? No. This is a awesome terrible cannon. one. Yes, my solution for everything is shoot it out of a cannon. If I can't shoot it out of a cannon, I get a bigger cannon. I definitely prefer my solution to everything. And if I can't get a bigger cannon, then I go for the solar uh, for a solar slingshot. Yeah, I definitely prefer my solution. It's simpler, easier, and nice. I will... I don't know. Okay. Uh, let's see. I needed... Got plenty of that. I'm out of Trank Bombs? That's not gonna help you on this quest anyway. You can't... Those have no effect on Elders. I know. But I was still just surprised to find that to be the case. And nobody, by the way, Aiza, nobody in this game has an actual name. No one does. They're all the Handler. Or Grumpy Scholar, or Eager Whatever. Nobody has an actual name. I know I made some Sticky Ammo 3. Well there. Got some now. I'm trying to think what weapon I should bring. All of them. Ice-based. No, I'll bring a hunting horn. Where is... Blight negated. Blight... Why have blight resist and blight negation? Fire resist up. Lard. Attack up. Ah! There's three attack up songs and one fire resist. Right now I'm making all the ammo. I don't think I'm going to be able to use any of it, but I'm making all of the ammo. I see. Yeah, but... It would be nice yeah. if I could actually use this ammo. But trying to find a gun that can actually use all of this elemental ammo is annoying.
Monster Field Guide updated for Black Diablos, Kushladora, Lunastra, Teostra, and Paolumu. Health up. That's sort of the best guy. Both with potion. Now I'll go for the one. Part of good. Okay. Oh good, you guys don't have to wait this time. Okay, fire resistance up or... Or blatant? Uh, you'll want fire resistance against this guy. Talking for my hunt. Tell me, Cyrus, do you have the overlay equipped from... Did you get from the couple? What overlay? You didn't get the overlay? What overlay? Go to the delivery place, deliver the stuff. After you f if you finish all that stuff and talk to the workshop again, do I want Wait, elemental do you mean resist? The, do, you, do, you, do you mean the mantle? The brigade. The brigade. Do I want yes, elemental uh, or defense? Element. Oh. You want oh. oh, that's why I'm barely hearing anything. The game was turned down really low. That sounds like a silly thing. Which thanks for reminding me of the elemental. Now it's too loud. All right, off we go. A hunting we will go. To adventures. Yes. I hope everyone remembered some cool drinks. Doesn't matter. I have this one. This one's gonna get hot. Gonna I have wide range five, stuff. and I have five cool drinks. <laughs> good. I like a good competition. Well, I mean, I did actually remember to grab cool drinks. So, meh. Oh, we have cool drinks in effect right now, so we're good. Oh, they've got that stuff. Hold up, I, I still need to drink my mega potions and mega, my, my megas, but... Zim it. But I'm what? Okay, I'm coming to you. Or I think I am. Red nigga bitch! Okay, I'm here. I am liking all these buffs. I am too. We kinda got brutally murdered last time I took this guy on. 
I feel like I would like to go and smack Lunestro in the face like this. Hello! I, um, I I'd like to talk to you about a wonderful business opportunity. No, sir, the dropping me into the lava does not assist in this business opportunity. You see, if you let me kill you, then I will give you a quick and pain painful death. Yes. That is business opportunity. You really shouldn't pass this up. He apparently does not like my business opportunity! He really did not like this. Oh, the war stopped my 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 replay. Well, it stopped me mounting him. Damn it! You made me miss. I was fired. How high can I go? Ah. How low can you go? How high can you go? Alright, get him to face me. I have... Go for the tail. Tail? You can cut the tail. Ah! <laughs> Stop moving, damn it! damage directly to his push where do you think you're going I do not give you permission for that have poison and more poison I miss with Okay, we need to turn this down just a little more. <laughs> this is why I like the bow gun. Not as fast of movement, but it's got a shield. Got it. wait for you to make it land and then I will smack that thing with a wyvern shot. Boom! <laughs> I like the wyvern ammo. We are in a bad position. Careful. Mouser, you're almost dead. I am not almost. I'm a half health. I'm fine. Oh, my teeth are on fire. Well, at least it's not your butt. Not everyone's more health. We're good. Hey, insane no sum. Sunu num. How are ya? Damn it! I did not give you permission to go flying off! Well, since we got this up, he's an elder dragon. He doesn't need your permission. I demand that he gives gets permission from me. Ah, uh, did the thing to indicate my th uh, my blade was sharpened full, but then it dropped to half again. I hate it when it does. Look out, supernova. Nova. I am doing well, insane. You haven't died yet. Surprisingly. But I, I was more referring to my emotional well-being. Oh. Um. 
so you guys left me while I was gathering stuff. But well, I am here now. How did that not get hit by that tail? Fucking fire. Ripped a few holes in his wing. Where's my spread ammo? Stick it. He's falling asleep, he's asleep, he's asleep. Oh crap, I'm... Sorry! I had stuff exploding. I was oh, gonna wake well. up anyway. I had a charge going. Where's my cluster bomb? No! Okay, can I stand up and move, please? No? Okay. Ooh. Stop roaring! Wanna get close enough to do this? to me, I suppose. I don't have to that is a very fierce gaze. I I can't even see where I am now. Ah! You're with inside of him. You're in a very bad place. I'm just done. of my shots do nothing. It's this flame aura. Well, he can just shove it. If I fire from there, another be careful. I don't know what that means, but okay. Big Maybe boom hurt a lot. Yeah. Oh. I, I'm guessing that was that. Nope. No. Oh. Come on. You've seen Lunastra's version. That's brutal. He hasn't done it. Lunastra. Nah. That one's well, next, I think. to look forward to. Oh, no. You're not the Lunastra yet. No? If it would stop flapping around, I could actually get a shot on it. Wyvern ammo. Right on the tail! Oh, attack push wore off. Let me do that. That would be appreciated. Ah, now he's flying away. Yeah! Run, little bitch! Yeah, he does that. Oh, cold drink we're off. So it is not in a lava area. Still, it increases your fire resistance. That is also true. Thank you. The blue scout flies are all over the place. They don't even know where they're going. Just come to us. Oh yeah, this area. Where he smashed through a pillar to get to me. Yep. I 
be aiming for his face said you blunt damage. Alright, thank you, insane. This is late class bots though. Apparently his roar is so fierce it knocks us back. Yep. Keep swinging that tail, I will cut it off. Nova. Nova. I don't know what to do. Dive. Get Dive. away from him. Dive. Drinking a potion for you. Thank you. Yeah, just dodge. As long as you're not using a lance or a gun lance, you'll be fine. Just you'll just dive and dodge it. Stop, dive, Ow. dive, and dodge. That's a cool dodge. Oh, your health is really my health is always low. I am bad at this game. Yeah, I, I took that uh, Nova thing <laughs> very much I had a frontal blast thingamajigger. Oosh! Oh. Tail still isn't off. You're like I cut the tail off like you're slicing ammo. Oh, uh, I have sli I have slicing ammo. Good. If you'd stop roaring and knocking me back. And running around and generally making my job of trying to aim a living nightmare. Oh. Okay, that wasn't out all that tickled. Ha! And I pull my hunting horn. Thank you. Ooh, he didn't like that. <laughs> He's leaving again. Yep. I have Dragon Pod. Hmm. I do believe he went down to a lava area. You're in good shape. Yeah. Now the blast, now his fast potter starts coming out. I carry spare bugs for that. And this is where, you know, our lovely friend, the B-52 bomber comes out. Ah, uh, B-52 won't join this quest. But he won't come. Well, that's lame. I want, to have, I want the B-52 bomber to blow this guy up. I need a bigger <laughs> cannon. Where he is going to land, I'm gonna plant bombs in his face. Okay, I'll prep it. my bombs too. I will prep Wyvern. Bring him down. Go Zim, set him off. Ah! Boosh! Nice. <laughs> and there goes Here's his off. tail. Nice. Oh, he's limping too. He's limping back. We can carve his tail. Or not. I'm going for it. Got it. Ow. Yes. 
Nova. Oh. Dive. Oh, I did my damn. best. I got it. Oh. That is not what I want to be doing. Go away, you stupid sling. By the way, I have like I have 26 fires. The Nova doesn't hurt terribly. I, I can't. It does have okay. the health, but there we go. What's with the C? I don't mind putting shooting some piercing ammo right up your butt. And he did not like that. He decided to come say so with his face. Took a lot of damage. Yeah, might as well carve the tail then. Oh, yeah, thank you, insane. That is helpful. Eruption. I almost ran into it too. I'm just gonna need to sharpen my weapons before we rush in there. Yeah, that's a good idea. What is this sharpen? If it's not which blue, sharpen it. Yeah, make sure your uh, hammer is nice and sharpened. Oh, yeah, right. oh okay. I wasn't aware oh, that your, your hammer needed yes. to be uh, sharp. But, okay. Hey, always sharpen your hammer, your hunting horn, everything unless you're using a gun. I have no idea, Insane. I know that it's one of them. I haven't actually... You're 11 shots? I've got a couple. I uh, blow him his face up in an alive and shot, wake him up like that. Uh, let me get over bonk, there. Bonk, 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 bonk. Let's see, wyvern ammo, there we go. Ready? Go for it. Oosh! Oh! 250 damage! Stop roaring so I can reload! A wyvern shot to the face is a nice way to wake up. The best part of waking up. <laughs> hey! Is that? Damn it! I just equipped my freaking. Ugh! My minigun. I just equipped it. Well, ca go carve your Teostra horns. Getting nothing but fire dragon scales. Yep. Literally nothing except fire dragon scales. Oh dear. And off of the tail as well. And what can I do for you? Why is the dance hula? That's what I wonder. Whew. We did it! Whew. Now this is a point where somebody can play one of my victory sounds. Da 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 Wrong game? So, that's one of the sounds I have. 
Ah, uh, it's exclamation point. Yep, there you go. Well, there is a cooldown on it. Uh, someone beat me to rodeo, champ, but at least I broke more parts. Uh, we also have a Mario victory. But no one cared about that. Yeah, nobody ever uses it. Because Mario is too long to type in than, than, than FF. There you go. My yeah. <laughs> feels and buffs, Jesus. What? Hundred and thirty one heals and buffs applied. Holy crap. I am nowhere on that. Hunting horn. And the wiggler hat. Yeah. Fine work. The wiggler hat is always useful. Every situation calls for one. So you're back. Good. I see your Elder Dragon investigation went smoothly. If by investigation you mean murder, yes. You're doing some fine work for us out in the field. Better than anyone we've ever put out there. For now, get some rest, okay? You can handle the remaining Elder Dragons later. By the way... By the way, there's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. I've discussed it with the scholars a number of times now. But we still can't determine why the Elder Dragons are riled up, even though we've gotten rid of Nergigante. Mm -hmm. The only thing we all seem to agree on is that something extremely out of the ordinary must be unfolding. Which means that there must be something causing it, even if we haven't been able to identify what just yet. So, what's the reason? Why are the Elder Dragons regrouping in the Elder's Recess, instead of staying dispersed? Is there something there? I wonder. And if so, perhaps that could be what my friend has been searching for all this time. Okay. The Argosy has returned. Well, let's talk to the guy for the, uh... I know, right? That was a lot of foreshadowing. Nah. Nobody's foreshadowing. It's foreshadowing. Well, I guess. I was just making a bad joke. Yeah, it was really bad. You should be ashamed. I always am. No, I'm never ashamed. You especially! Although, I did like my Destiny 2 joke. Good now, why would I be ashamed? Puns. I'm thankful. Not my fault you can't take a little punishment. I am... Ugh. Careful, he'll become a Punisher. You know what? This is fine. This is fine. <laughs> yep, this is all totally fine. Mm. I'm mentally imaging Zim holding his finger over the band button now. Now, you know that thing people always do when they're stressed out and really trying to calm down and they start rub it, uh, rub, rubbing that bit behind the ears in the circular patterns? I'm just imagining him doing that right now. I mean, except for the fact that you guys can literally see me and what I'm doing. I have one monitor. I don't... <laughs> Yeah, admittedly, I have the stream on pause, so I only I can see the chat, but I can't see the video because, frankly, hearing your voice 
repeated on the stream after you've said it in here it tends to be a bit weird. Oh, I get it. You should mute the stream. Yeah, but then I have a video playing in the background while I'm playing this. Now, Cyrus, oh, no, I do provider. have a very important task for you. What's that? I need you to Hello? open a browser and yep. go to adminnotice.com. Someone call out? No. Uh, Neon, right now the game is full, unfortunately. But I'm not sure how much longer are you going to be here for, uh, Cyrus? Well, I actually booked the day that the Monday off work, so I'm not on any restriction. Oh, cool. And that's mainly because I knew the coach was going to be getting in about half midnight. I think Teostra is the one I just finished. Yeah, that was Teostra. Toaster. I really need some... Uh, some new bow guns. Like, higher power ones. But I don't know which one to pick. Like, which one would be good to go for? I like a nice variety of uh, shots. Never mind! I think I found which one I want. We gotta go hunt Teostra a bunch. Gigante. Either one would work. You know what? Let's go hunt, uh, hunt us some Nergigante. I want to get a new bow gun. I have a quest for that. Is anybody even there? I have Nergigante quests, but yes. I, you you won't want these ones. Uh, let's see. Fantastic person, a friend that I got the game for when it was on sale. It's like, how do I hunt monsters? I'm like, oh, oh dear. Yes, oh. what can I do for you? Wait a minute. I'm trying to find some. Nurkagante. Ah, oh, there it is. Eater of Elders. Quest is posted. Because I need a lot of parts from him to get that uh, gun. Yeah, it is. I do not want to talk to you, but you've got an exclamation point. I'll just skip through this as hmm. fast as I possibly can. Hmm. No. Quest is posted! Whoever wants to join.
Okay, is anybody there? Yes, give me a second. I'm trying. Okay. Um, nobody here but us chickens. Nobody was responding. Don't worry, dear. We're here. Don't worry. Uh, insane. You should get on voice if you're going to come play with us. You at least have to be able to hear. Uh, real time, not stream delay. Well, while you're preparing, I'm just gonna go and quickly f uh, throw some stuff in this tea. Waiting for a fourth person to join. Can we, uh, capture Nergigante? No. Oh. There's my cluster bombs. Okay, we've got three people here. Where's the fourth? We somebody else anybody else gonna join? Sorry, right, just trying to help someone double something real quick. Um Health, wind pressure, and defense. Those are just collecting all those bugs. Yep. Why'd you leave? The buoy doesn't love me anymore. He doesn't love me. You should all... I don't know what. Are you guys ready? We'll wait on Cyrus. Hmm. 
The weasels. God damn it. Uh. Okay. <laughs> yep, that's a full game. What? What's a full game? Who? The party's full. Oh, yeah, right now Plus. it is. I'm looking Nerg again and saying the face right now. Uh, guess I will head in your general direction. I have not yet drank my skin and demon drug, so do not aggro. Yeah, oh, don't, so don't aggro yet. I'm slowly making my way there. If I can figure out which way that looks like I can get there this way. I might be we getting should, sidetracked show the camp. gathering. Is there another camp here? Oh, there's two more camps in this area. Yeah, at least show me one other this time. Please. Because one is right next to where Nergi spawns. That would be helpful since we've got to, uh... Stop uh, playing Gad, like, resource Pokemon. <laughs> but, but, they're the resources. Where's the, uh, camp? On the other side of Mary. No, it's not on the other side, it's right over here. Hmm, flame nut. A spicy treat. This side. Right down here. I think we could build the camp here. Let's ask the Yay! Hey. New camp discovered. What up, Nobby? They're also so much higher level and have gathered all this stuff already. Alright. I'm ready to go. Ah, oh, Nerga Gantai, so nice to see you on your own this time. And then B-52. No, he's another dragon, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> okay, defense, health, and then attack. Ow! Saved your life. Ah! There you go. Incoming. This is the spikiest seat of all. So that almost. That what? A Shakespeare play. What was this? You mean Macbeth? Yeah. I, I think I managed to poison him. You did. Yeah. I did a good! Now you just need to dragon play him. I don't think I've got that. Yet. Ooh, 
I have bunked. Ow! Stop jumping on me! Oh. slicing his tail. Come on, Nergi. Come closer. I dare you. Ha! But you double dog dare him. Yes. Attack and defense wall. Okay. Don't touch me. Buffing. Yeah, I don't have a whole lot of resources, eyes in myself. Uh, at least not as many as I need, apparently. Well, at least I threw a uh, sticky ammo in his mouth. Hmm. And now he can't chew things. That room. I, I mean, that is acceptable now, now, for now me. I'm just gonna have to deal with an extremely expensive dental bill, thanks to you. Oh God! Now I feel bad for him. I know how horrible those. Dental bills oh, that was day. nicely positioned for me. Oh, he really didn't go far. Don't roar in my face. I have to clean my hat. It's, it's a free country. Technically not. Actually, what is the government of Monster Hunter? We are the government. Sorry. Yeah. We but all are the hierarchical. It's strictly hierarchical. more pushed against Nergi than them than they am against them. There, got you with the recover ammo. Not that you probably needed it at all, but I uh, still did something to help. Yep, he shot you with medicine at uh, the speed of sound to heal you. Yes. Oh, did you already fight the uh the dragon who pushes you back a lot to not Trishala? Yeah. Did you fight Trishala yet? Yes, yes. We re Trishala was our first dragon to box out fight. Yeah, Kushla wins dragon is a pain in the ass. He is probably, in my opinion, the least fun, uh, yeah, least fun dragon in the whole game. In this series. Oh, not really the series, <laughs> maybe. I don't know, there's like a few keep away monsters that push things quite a bit. Ugh! Would you stand still? Impression 
Okay. okay, you don't need to come towards me, just stand still. Oh, is that me? He is... yeah. Let him go to sleep. I want to shoot him in the face with a wyvern. Interrupting my attack. Boom! Still got to shoot him in the face. Oh, max potion, okay. I'll waste my potion then. Him hit you again after he already get full <laughs> health again and make me use another potion. <laughs> Does that heal? Does Bringing him to the ground. Yeah. Huh. But you have to have the mushroom pants. I believe uh. I do. I will cut your tail off with my horn. Boom! I did not. I, just, I failed to cut the tail off with my horn. Ooh, mining. Ooh, piercing pots. Can wow, that's Gigante, useful. Yeah, can Gigante even regenerate his head horns? No. Hi, right, just yeah. wondering. If so, the horn take. Really long. So, some of the Nergigante's theme is that he can just regenerate on the spot, so I was just wondering. Yeah, but it's still, he it's regenerates just his spine. the spikes. That's it. Yeah, yeah, it's not like park. You can't cut off his tail and then regenerate it and cut it off again. Yeah, well, I figure if that happened, they just wouldn't let you carve it again and again and again. Where need is the bump your spiky boy? Tail is here. Did you cut off the tail? No. No? You'll probably want to try and synchronize your hits here if you want to break both the tails. Or if you want, he can just cluster bomb. You want Actually, me to cluster bomb? Better. Yeah, cluster yeah, bomb. Last one. Aim it for the middle. Oh. I got him. I, I was aiming for the one in the back. I didn't realize there were some in the front. Sorry. Damn it. Dodge the bomb. Ow! Dodge everything. Temporal mantle, go! Special searches. Alright, let's do this. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> Ten runs from the magazine. Aww. Oh, well. Besides, you should feel sorry for me. The weapon I want requires me to fight Diora over and over and over again. I feel you though, I need to hunt Dior for one of my weapons. I think you can't even wind immunity out of the tornadoes. Hmm. All wind pressure. Negate all wind pressure. You just ignore his wind mantle. Yeah, which sounds essential. I have one horn that gives it. The other songs suck for it. Nice grab there, Aizen. Yay, I got yeah. a bounty complete. And you found your skull. 
that it's unknown because you don't even know yourself. Hmm. But who what? does? What? Take yeah. But you that's... know what else I need to? You know what else I need for my weapons? Majestic horns. I finally got a. I need some mm. of those too. Is that Kieran's? No. No, that's Kieran not is. A, is a, uh, yeah, Kieran's a different one. The Diablos is this one. We have to that's break both horns. Thankfully, not Black Diablo. Yeah, those come after the majestic horns. Don't remind me. <laughs> I've no. Hey, my yeah. tail raiders uh, returned. <laughs> I still need to talk to the developers about letting me play a, uh... Feline. Like in Generations? Yeah. Don't know why they don't have it in this. Don't know why they haven't added more monsters. Oh, uh, for monsters, it's because... Uh, in most of the games, they just transferred assets. They couldn't do it with this. They had to, like, remake, remake a them. whole cloth. Yeah. But on the plus side, on the plus side, they can just reuse assets for Monster Hunter World 2. Indeed. Uh, Monster and the Hunter World Ultimate. And then there will be Monster Hunter World Super Ultimate. I'd rather have Monster Hunter World Evolution. Uh, no, no, it would be Monster Hunter Evolution Ultimate Tri G. <laughs> EX. <laughs> Definitive Edition. No, Extra Edition. Because with all those titles, it has to be extra. Yeah. Game of the year. Sadly, I'd buy that. It, it, any of you ever play Dungeons & Dragons? Yeah. Really? 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 It, really? Anyway. <laughs> uh, <you know. laughs> You know how, like, every suffix and prefix you add to a weapon is essentially, like, equal to a certain amount of pluses? We just created an epic Monster Hunter game. Wait, wait. Oh, Dungeons and Dragons or Diablo? Oh, gosh. Processing. That would be an amazing system. It could just add, like, suffixes and prefixes to, like, monsters you hunt so you could fight a flaming Diablo. No. Blazing Kirin. Yeah. Oh, I just noticed That'd be awesome. the. Um, I just noticed the uh, quest available in the oh, events. Oh, Great Giros, that spiky, rolly one, a Duggeron, and B fifty two. I'd love to do the event where we fight two Kyrens at once. Did you guys do that one already? Was that the one in the It would be better if they were tempered. Hmm. Yeah, they're low rank. They're not even high rank. Do what? Yeah. It's, it's two low level Kyrens, though, what so it's more than possible. Hellish Fiend Valhazak. Oh, that's an easy one. Yeah, that's mm. No, yeah, I'm Valhazak going to. I'm gonna travel back to Astera just to avoid having to talk to Navi. Uh, for Valhazak, make sure you have a lot of null berries. Don't worry, I have ten. Ha! Full steam ahead! Uh, Valhazak, I just I... a Fluvia ring. Yeah. Valhazak, I feel, is like the second equipment uh, check. Well, not the second. Another equipment check the game has. It's 
I'm bringing my my blight resistance up and my blight negated horn for this. Okay, so to do the camp and elders recess, I need a dodo gamma hide plus. Well, yeah, I'll just have to fight up plus dodo gamma. Dodo gamma bada. Yeah. Hello, yeah. yeah. Crim King. Welcome, welcome. It is a pleasure to have such a royal presence in the chat. Do not ask. It's Regal Rim coming to a store near you. Batteries not included. Because you pay for royalty. Royalty don't pay for you. I still need a lot more stuff from Ner uh, from Nergigante. Like a tail. A tail, regrowth pr uh, plate, and two more talons. I really wish you guys could just transfer, uh, trade stuff and just give it, you know. Mm, we kind of ruin things, I, I guess. Man. So I wish that maybe a few things could be transferred. Like, oh, well, here's arms, I guess. You can have all the arms you want. All the arms you want. Um. Oh, I forgot the name of that deity. <gasps> Selling equipment, you monster! That reminds me, I've got a whole load of Cold Taroth stuff I need to sell. Oh my god, yeah. Thanks for reminding me. I do hope when they make a sequel, they make armor up quite a bit more paintable than it is now. Hmm. Give us stickers. Oh god. Because I know it upgrades again, but it's just you get to choose more colors. It's not you get to paint more sections of the armor. Can't be like, oh, I want this metallic part to look, I don't know, purple. Something like Warframe color, color stuff. You have your primary, your secondary, so on. Oh gosh, you want to know what I'm surprised at? That Zim doesn't have a picture art already done of Zim, except he's like a Co Toby Kodachi fur. Um... Clearly, you haven't seen the Monday D and D groups. Uh, my group picture from there. Oh, uh, you did do it. I mean, not quite exactly what you're talking about, but hey, let me bring it up on stream. There it is. Well, some game is still going on for your big fat information. Cancel. Hmm, shrink it down a bit so it'll actually fit on the screen. There we go. That looks, that looks like a giant weasel. It looks it, okay. That it, is Toby like Kale. Monster, it's like Monster Rancher, but what did he combine it with? There's there's some uh, um, hair. It looks like you combined a Toby Kadachi with the hair. I combined it with the ferret. No, with the hair. That that's the monster's name, hair. It's no. a rabbit, and it kind of gets that coloration in all its combinations. 
No, she combined. I had her combine it with the uh, uh, with a ferret because you know that's just kind of how. Uh, that's, you know, all of my games have had a ferret. Uh, I've had a ferret companion in all of the games so far. So this one, it's like, I'm going to have a Toby Kadachi ferret thing. Uh, I, I call I'm him, just hoping. I call him Toby Kale. Yeah. I'm just hoping that little trap I said in one of Zim's games goes off. And it goes off so well that he ends up having to get stupid art for it. And he just, like, says every time he sees me, I hate you. I hate you so much. That's that's my hope. You hope that I will hate you. Well, no, you. I don't think you're literally going to hate me. I just mean that's what you're going to say. And that is what you said when I actually set the trap. Yeah, I have a feeling the trap's never going to go off, but okay. But it will be there, lurking. Some random NPC sets it off. Oh no, it, it, it's a trap for the players. It'll so that be, be in there at some point. It's just a matter of whether the players actually, you know, wind up interacting with it. Yeah. So, I'm a DM that I had for a D&D game once discussed a bunch of traps with me once. Now, about two years later, I'm in a and d game with him, and he starts describing a trap. And my first thought was, this sounds familiar. And he must have realized it, because he made sure I was the last of the players to actually try to solve it. So only after everyone else had become uh, had fallen afoul of the trap did he let me try to get through the one room the trap was in. Yeah. In this case, the trap and is then he less... That one. Oh, continue. No, I'll just stop you. Then he wrote on that one. Alright, quest is posted. Yeah. The, the, the trap I lead is less a, a literal trap and more just... Because I don't know. Unfortunately, Nintendo is really, you know, hitting it out of the park with all of their releases. And I'm barely able to... I, I gotta get through Pokemon Let's Go before... Uh, Smash Bros. come out, and, you know. Oh, I look forward to that. I do, too. I am so excited for Smash Bros. Simply because of the adventure mode coming back. Yes, oh, it right. looks like... That. It looks like it's basically just a series of fights, but I don't care. At least it's something. After adventure mode, are you going to be doing online... Streams like just online player, multiplayer. Probably not. Damn. Everyone but I might grab bike. my roommate to do that. I I will probably make my roommate do that. Is your roommate Toto Dial? No, my roommate is a for. He used to do a lot of Smash Brothers tournaments. He is really good the only way I managed to get anywhere near beating him is when I kind of play cheap with uh, <laughs> with Pac-Man and his uh, little fire hydrant <laughs> I love his oh, fire, fire hydrant, hydrant side smash and fly at him yeah Man, I hope that game is balanced so bad. Insanium, I'm glad we think alike. What did he uh, say? I don't know how to play Hammer. 
Well, it spawned me somewhere else. Outside of the... Just a thought. Did anyone bring traps? Yes. Good, because... Okay. Oh, yeah. We do need to capture no. And on the bright side, if the game's broken, at least we'll have five balanced characters. What do you mean? For some reason, uh, they balance DLC characters, and I don't know why. Like, they'll actually patch them and everything. Wow! Hi! Yeah, as in's pretty right, all fighting game stories are just a series of fights. The game that kind of suffered the most from it is the Mo uh, Mortal Kombat 9? I mean, their first, uh... Their first adventure mode was actually pretty decent. Subspace Emissary? Yeah. No. No. The first version was on, was on, me was on melee. That was the... Yeah, melee like, actually had adventure mode. The, subs the subspace emissary was pretty, pretty decent. This is not what I wanted to harvest. I just want to know what happened to that Nintendo. That made Sakurai, like, go against so much of his, uh... Design philosophy. What do you mean, blown to smithereens? Oh, don't. Uh, I have nothing more. Sorry. Like, yeah, like, what gun did Nintendo, Ow. like, hold to his head? No, just to make him make another one in the first place. Sakura said he was done with that. Yeah, but he said that after almost everyone since the movie. But, yeah, that's true, too. Yeah, like, he's doing everything he does to do. Like, balancing things and not making the same strike. I think they probably were like, okay, just make one final good one and make it perfect. I think that's probably yeah. what they basically did. Yeah, we tried to go for a purely casual audience and it didn't pay off for some reason. We want you to bring in both the hardcore and casual audience. But sir, I only try to appeal by to a casual audience by making all winning or losing a flip of a coin. That no one liked that game. What? Uh, sorry. I, I was uh, referencing uh, one of the Mario Karts where whether you win or lose at a race was literally luck. Because right before you land, item. yeah, every item would hit you. This poor Dodo Goblin. Ow. Remember, you guys are one with nature. At least he doesn't move fast. So I can drink I my potions him. in peace. Oh, he's, uh, he's got the skull. Already? Kill him. No, he no didn't. capture! Yeah. I don't see it, so... I would love the last boss of Monster Hunter story to kind of make it into the main games. Because it was actually kind of a neat monster. With, like, a good angle. I think you are. Yeah, there we go. Yes, I had a trap. Yay! Um, I just like to, uh, drink before trapping. Oh, you still have work. It's a good thing that was fast, because I, uh... Forgot to restock my ammo. 
Alright, I got the hide. I think that's what I needed. Uh, he forgot to restock his ammo. I have no respect for him anymore. You had respect for me in the first place? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's the response I was expecting. Complete deliveries. I'm getting some new gems. De sorry, decoration. Yeah, they're called decorations, but all the decoration names are jewels. What? Did yeah? Did Zim get the kitty cat quest for the elder resources? I have no idea. Oh wait, you have to do all the kitty cat quests to even do the elder recess kitty yep. cat quest. Yep. Okay, now. Back to Nogigante. Well, that's enough hammer for me today. Now that I've got the Northwest camp. <laughs> Don't forget the uh, ammo. I'm already on it. Thank you, though. How much pizza do you think Nergigante would eat before he's satisfied? Pizza? One Elder Dragon's worth. Dude, I would love some pizza. Sounds good right so, now, actually. Yeah, so if you fed a hundred Zims worth of pizza, this entire game would have been resolved. Um... What? Uh, I'm also like, what? What? Anyways, Nergigante quest posted. Let's go. Let's do this. Orderly wedding. We're waiting for people to join. Hey! You got Still would love it if the sub- if, uh, the, the putty guys from Subspace Emissary became a character in the game. It'd be better than Piranha guys, Plant. I, when you said Putty Guys, I honestly thought of Power Ranger. The Piranha Plant got in because every game has to have the what the heck character. A, and that's him. He also actually you know, looks a little fun. That is a good point. At least it is it is a hundred times better than the Wii Fit Trainer. Yeah. I kind of, you know what's what sucks is I was like, okay, you know what? I'll I'll try to use the Wii but, Fit Trainer. It's kind of interesting. Turns out she sucks. She sucks so bad. She's terrible. But still, Lionel Waluigi. Huh? But still, Lionel. Wah! Wah! Oh, uh, because his trophy's popular. I actually don't... Do you know my name? That would be funny if that's the actual explanation. That is trophies too popular to make him a character. I don't think Nintendo is connected enough with the internet as a whole to actually know what's popular. I forgot. Yeah. And... Okay, okay. I do not have um wide range on. The don't die. actual... Yeah, the actual explanation, uh, there's probably two explanations. One is, he might not be that popular in Japan, which is kind of a huge factor. But then again, like, how long did it take him until he finally gave in and allowed Ridley in? And two... I mean, Metroid does need another character. Yeah. And, Ridley was yeah, that choice. It did. And now we got two additionals. Uh, the other is Sakurai was actually kind of harassed about it, so he might just be kind of vindictive. The paralysis mount. Then again, every character who's in has been in a main Mario game, or main video game, except Waluigi, so 
Well, Luigi was just using Mario Tennis. He was in side games. He only even... existence was to be a partner for Walu or for Wario. Yeah, that's essentially it. That's his only reason for being. And the only and there was only one game where he was the boss, like the final boss. Guess which one it was. Which? Oh lag. Uh it was the Mario Dance Dance Revolution game. <laughs> ah. Have I died? No, you, no, you left the quest. Oh, wonderful. So, yes, you did die. In Hi, Nerdy! Mercy. It's kind of fun. It's kind of funny because if I'm thinking about Mario characters with relevance, like, it's like, oh, have we got the frog guy in yet? Why not Slippy? Fuck Slippy. Nobody wants that. It would it's only a power would be help me, Star Fox. Yeah, it's kind of funny because in the first game, while we got in trouble a lot, he did. He never died. Slippy's immortal. Yeah, he doesn't die in Star Fox Pass with Frontless either. He never gets shot down. That's not how the only, he's only, he only turns up in battle in Star Fox Battle for Atlas if, uh, you, if you use Fox McCloud's special ability anyway. And yes, I know it's not actually called Star Fox, but I, 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 I'm calling it that anyway. It's fine. It's like how people uh, call it Zelda 64. Oh, Even what? There's two. Zelda Ocarina of Time. People call it Zelda 64. I have never I heard it called it. Zelda 64. I haven't heard it called that either. My brother. You, you can't do that because it's... there's Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Which one are you talking about? Zelda 64. Yeah, I have never. I have never heard it. They what both had a golden Zelda version. game I played was uh, Lord of Gamelon. You poor bastard. Yeah, <laughs> that's the only acceptable response. Whoa! It sure is boring in here. My boy, this piece is what all true boys. I want to know who fun. calls it uh, Zelda 64 as well. So I'm no longer in the quest. I'm just going to do a quick uh, Google search. Zelda 64. Let's see which one pops up. Probably both. Google's probably gonna think you're Ocarina looking for. Film? Ah. Ah. Get buffed. Are you, you, you know, gonna rejoin like, it? You know what's sad? On the Gamelon would be the perfect, so bad it's good game if its gameplay wasn't so torturous. Like, the cutscene would be beloved as, like, Hilariously bad. Wasn't that the one that was the CDs? Yeah, yes. that was one of them. I, I think they had three of those. Or am I thinking of the uh, Zelda ones? Hello and salutations. Now you must die. Oh, it didn't bring him down. Okay. Okay. How long until we get the Final Fantasy stuff? I mean the Behemoth? The Buster Sword? There, there's a lot more than the Behemoth, such as uh, Super Kukakalaku. Yeah. Oh, I mean, that's 
Yeah, it's technically just a giant Kula Boo who can never lose its rock. That's essentially what that fight is. Is it supposed to be a Chocobo? Hey! Whoever dropped, are you coming back in? Putting another box. <laughs> Ow. I don't know if they're actually coming out with another Monster Hunter Beans. event thing. I think they are. I they should be working on Behemoth now. No, no, I mean, they've already released the Behemoth for the PS4, but... I'm wondering I if heard, they have it. Uh, for the anniversary, they're supposedly releasing the Black Dragon Alatry. I probably said that wrong. Although that's not confirmed information. The Black Dragons? So they're bringing uh, De Devil Joe? No, wait, Devil Joe's in this game. Yeah. Devil Joe's a green. Yeah. There's only three Black Dragons. Did we cut off his tail? Oh, okay, no. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I'm just gonna look up the guide. Maybe the guide has it. I wish I knew where to look. Alright, all the bombs on his tail. Let's cut it off. Because I need one. I don't have room for bombs. Too many support items. No, I didn't bring bombs. I would need to craft some more at some point. Alright, whatever ammo it is. Let's see. I can't use this. I don't know. So they're bringing in one more monster. It would be interesting if you could actually, like, cut off their arms and stuff as well. That would be a different rated game. Nah. Also, I believe... Also, I believe in Japan, you can't, like, have a person's arm not on their body or something without being heavily censored. It's weird and stupid. If you, if you play... I can't get back to What I mean? Yeah, Weird. if you played Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 and you were like, Hey, why is Fut why does Future Gohan have two arms? That's why it's censorship. Really hmm. dumb censorship. It's like, people without arms exist! Uh, yeah, my blood sibling. So he also lost his arm because he was an idiot. Right, but who the heck, why censor someone not really having an arm? That he lost his arm. Huh? What'd you say? It's canon that he lost his arm. Why would someone have an arm? Like, unless he's from the time before Anders where he lost his arm? No, no, no. It's from after he lost his arm. But because of Japanese censorship, they can't have him... Uh, not have an arm, or else it would like go past the rating they were going for. Past the like teen rating, it'd be like adult rating, mature rating. Yeah, I think it's child rating they went for, and it would. Did we get his tail off? Yes. Yes, that we did. Was his tail, yes. Yeah, it's kind of weird. You can kill someone, but having someone who just doesn't have an arm is like too adult for the Asadians, apparently. Okay, please actually give me the tail. I'm gonna scale off the tail. Good, I got a tail. Look, there's a tail here. I think I'll just take a 
You know, you just need two more. <laughs> I still remember the chocobo song. Well, I got one Joe's of the talons I need. Now I need another talon. Oh, now you need two more talons. Oh, you got a gem. I like yeah, I got a gem too. last time. Must be nice. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Damalsa. Thank you. Thank you. You are very kind. Yeah. If there is one thing I will say about Smash, the current Eisen, Smash Bros. is sometimes I Find me a good chirp sound for Chocobo, and I will add that. Though I'm more referring to lines like the evil bird. Kill it, it's evil. Bravo. Mostly to bother the Tuesday DM. Is he a bird? He's a bird. Really? You're not going to bug the Monday DM? How would I bug Riseroth? Why not? Yeah, why not? I said how? Just not trying hard enough. No, with that attitude. Huh? Um, yeah. Yeah, uh, let's see. I need to get an engine anthem. Gem. Oh. This means there's four active games going on. Three of which are streamed. Mm -hmm. As far as Anjnath gems go, we could do Code Red. I do also need Anjnath. We should do Code Red. Yeah, we should definitely do Code Red. What is that? That is where you'll you see. The Devil May Cry. You'll see. Is that one of the advanced ones? It is. Advanced I've just posted this as a quest. I don't I have it available the... to me. You Wait, really? It. It's it's MR fourteen. Dude, that is four monsters. Yes, yeah, they're easy. Easy. Yeah, we seriously outpower them. Easy, they say. Remember uh, also that it adjusts the uh, monsters as well. Yeah, if you're, when you have multiple monsters. I, I warn it's been a kind of a little while since I played, so... Uh... That said, make sure you have meals before you leave, because I recall this arena doesn't have... Uh, at least Teostra can't do his, like, ultimate attack of turning the entire arena into a hellscape. I mean, he still does Supernova, though. That's true. He tries to. Flash. He tries to. Yeah. Aizen, I am entirely expecting to be brutally murdered on this. I'm just expecting that to happen. Just keep yourself pointed towards the monster and block everything. Fine. I should send Zim <laughs> that, like, song... Which is like, all it is is like, you can do it, and it just keeps going. Like, it keeps upping the ridiculousness of, like, how it's trying to boost your confidence. It just becomes hilarious. Oh, uh, too bad you can't put links in Twitch. Heck. Whatever. Ah, uh, I could do it there in medium. Ones. I could do it in medium sharing. Let's see if I can't find it. Can I close that?
Dang it. Uh... Okay. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna die so much in this. I just know it. Oh, I can't. Mm. I can't find it. The the thing has a name, but I don't know the name of the actual song. Um, am I supposed to be hearing cultist whispering? Maybe. Yes, that's normal. Okay. Winker, Jager. Oh, is it one at a time? Yes. Yeah, it's one at a time. I mentioned that earlier. Oh, hey, this is an Anjanath, isn't it? Yep. Good. I want his armor. It's not a plus, though. What do you mean? Okay. What's up? Oh no, it's not. This is not a high rank? They're all high rank. Then why isn't it a well, I'm confused. Oh, I No! <laughs> Damn it! music. There's Devil May Cry music. Nah, I've never actually played the game. I think I tried at one point and it, uh, the game would not work on my computer at the time, so... I heard something about Resident Evil and uh, Monster Hunter. I don't know what that was about. It might have just been a rumor. Probably just a rumor. Because how they gonna use zombies in here other than bringing in, um, well, the zombie You'll monster. be fighting William Birkin. It, it's probably more like uh, it will be like a monster inspired by Resident Evil, like, you know. Incoming! Like how, it will be a full new monster. Yeah, like how in Peace Walker, there was like a, uh... <laughs> I said incoming! As a hit. <laughs> in Peace Walker, there was a Metal Gear Rex that you could fight, and it's like a monster version of Metal Gear Rex. Like I could, I could see them doing, um, not Resident Evil, but what's that other one? Souls and oh, Goblins. Uh, Frank West. Dead oh, Rising. he did walls, you know. He did walls. He covered walls, you know. No! Do not eat me! Man, I am so sad. What happened to that series? Like. No, no series deserves what happened to it. 
to what, Dead Rising? Yeah, it was handed over to people who actually, like, hate the series. And then by the time, like, Capcom caught on to this, like, it was too late, like, damage has been done. There's, like, a whole, uh, documentary on it. It was for me, too. Alright, give me all the pelt. What the? <laughs> it died and just slid across the floor. Oh, this is enhanced. Never mind, I thought these were all going to be base. Give me pelts! I got a gem and a plate. You... I, I hate you. And I don't you need to take them. I, I needed pelts, not that. You can't capture them in an arena. Yes, you can. Yeah, you can. Is there a... Really? Uh... Yes, you can. Yep, they just don't tell you when a monster can be captured. That's Is why you watch the pulse. Oh, okay. That's why you they don't believe instead. me when I say you can tell how much health they have by the pulse. Well, I have two of them. Two of them. Where's the next one? Give it Come a trap. I proved this with um. Here we come. The arena of Toby. Explosions. <laughs> Poor guy. Ajanath had a better chance against us. Yeah, we really were. Until I accidentally put off and then took off my uh, oxygen handle. <laughs> Can you tell where Stone Age? Well, sort of. What? I don't know, a tech kid in this game is kind of all over the place when I think about it. I would never have guessed Stone Age, ever. I guess that was more of a thing early in the series. Yeah, there's been a lot of progress in technology in the I mean, look at the... Look at how the switch axe works. That's some advanced technology there. Plus, now we can genetically alter monsters. As long as they fit the skeleton model. What? It would be neat if they added, like... Uh, I can't remember what they're called, but it's usually just the monster with, like, a plus or something, and it's, like, a mechanically enhanced version of them. Yep, Deviant. I mounted the dog. Not on this stream, please. You don't need to draw Fine, I'll get off him and you can that. deal with him normally then. Drawing attention to that is not pretty, it makes it worse. It makes it much worse. Now don't mind me while I, you know, shoot it up the bit. There we go. Toby isn't gonna Toby's show in. up here, is he? No. Nope. Good. The next Maybe one you might. Captain. The next one is a, a bit of a signature monster. Flagship. No. The one that everyone uh, who knows of Monster Hunter knows. Which, by the way, isn't showing in the new Smash. He's a boss. Explosions. 
Is there somewhere I can restock on ammo? No. No. Yay. Which, by the way, I don't think they had they had a hunter for Smash. They might in the DLC. I don't know. I don't believe them when they are like that they're holding back the DLC to see which characters are most popular. I bet you they know exactly what characters they want right now. Incoming! Oh no you don't. At least I hit him partially with that. Did we both go rolling down the back? I, I love uh, that roll attack on the last boss. Yeah, so far. Or cool. Yeah. You just, you just rolling down her back to say yell like, yeah! Yeah. You cannot escape from my wrath. Did me see really aim for face from Canada? It, it I do that. my best. Damn it. That missed. Not like I can exactly, you know, get that good of a shot when he's flying and flapping and running and generally does not hold still. You can literally just walk right up to his face and do it. It'll just pop on his face. But not all of it. You'll have another opportunity to help uh, to hit him in a second. Uh oh, I'm spinning. Someone hit me. There, there you go. go. I shot you. With a gun. Bring him to the ground. Oh no, no, no. Boosh! Why? What have I done? <laughs> Neon, hold still for a moment. There. Ah! No! Okay, that's it. You get down. Oh, why aren't I hitting? Neon, your health. What? Help with what? Health! Oh, yeah, I know. So I got him covered.
remember that he has a tail, and I dropped a beautiful uh, a scale off him. But oh, so, um, so, uh, Zim, are you ready for the next one? No. Why not? Because I'm out of, uh, I'm running horribly low on ammo. Oh dear. Yes, what can I do for you? Tell me. What do you think the next one is? I have no freaking clue. It's El Diablo. Oh, oh good. I, I need majestic horns. Be, uh, oh no, it's not actually Diablos. It's definitely a fire based creature. Uh, no, no, no. It's El Diablo. El Diablo de Fuego. It's the fire elder dragon thing that we just. Oh god. Told ya. Said you like it. I do not like it. I'm gonna act. Actually... I can't hit it anywhere. <laughs> you can yell it. If you hit both both mouse buttons, you just swap. You just whack. It's flying. Do we at least have a Dragonator here? No. No. Damn it. Oh crud. Oh, where's my Dragonator? Oh, I'm surprised this monster can't just get you off by exploding himself. Sometimes I feel like they're a little bit too helpless when you mount them. He doesn't want to kill. He just wants to knock you out. It's like lava soft. It's like why? Why don't you just jump into the lava? I don't think I could follow that. I'm not going to get this. Hey, there we go. On the plus side, if you die, you can re -ammo. No, it's true. No, no, there's no uh, item. There's no tent. That's nothing but zeros. Yay. Well, there I go. I play overly defensively against this guy because I haven't really got his pattern down yet. Just go in, hit him until he dies. It's my philosophy. I do know that you can avoid his uh, huge explosion by doing the the, the leap. Well, yes, at least I dive. got some more pierce and spread ammo in the supply box. Not that it's gonna do a whole lot of good. It's better now. Debatable. Nova. Flash. Nice. I was waiting for it. I knew it was coming. And we knocked him over. Music's gone. Damn it. Don't worry. When you engage. Oh god, I hope it's not copyrighted. And again, this whole video, this video will be copyrighted because Capcom's like, sorry, but there's, uh, our, our game's in it, so you can't do anything. Yeah, what kind of sucks is it's not exactly legal what they're doing, but 
it's kind of one of those things where it, it, it is entirely legal, legal for them to do that. No, I. Uh... They do uh, own the copyright of this game. Yeah, I believe it's in their um, the end user. Even there, even if it wasn't, I mean, they have full right to do whatever they want with their game. It just Story sucks hub. for content creators. There's a, a sort of legal thing there, but it's like the happy birthday song. People knew it wasn't owned by the company who uh, owned it for a while, but no one was going to challenge it. They might not actually be able to put real restrictions on Let's Plays. No, they could. They could just have the videos taken down. I think it would be... Yeah, and how's that worked out for a lot of companies in the past? I'm saying they could, not that they would. Well, I'm saying that if or it, that it would to go court, well. who would win would be up for debate. No, who would win would be them. They didn't win quite a few times. It depends on whether you they try to claim it as... I cannot claim that this is... Exactly. They, if somebody is making money off of it, they can say, fuck off. But they, you can say it's transformative in nature. No, I can't. Yes, you can. Let's Plays are not transformative. According to what court? Uh, according to the U.S. law? Trust me, I've looked into all of this stuff. As a streamer who can't afford to have that kind of drama? I could, I, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, it's... We have no legal right to be able to do any of this. Transformative means that it's... We just have no legal right to do this. But companies allow us. The thing about Let's Plays and streams like this, though, is a lot of companies do like them because it's free advertising for them. Exactly. Capcom's back password still. Capcom it allows me. They don't monetize the video themselves, which in my opinion is perfectly fine. They're not trying to make money off of my I work. I still think it's a legal gray area that just hasn't simply had wrong. its day in court. Yeah, exactly, Eisen. The uh, companies allow it because it is free advertising. A lot of companies are perfectly okay with it, and a, a lot of them even go further and actively support streamers. Uh, such as, uh... There's some material over here if you guys didn't get it. A lustrous uh, One scale. of the examples I quite liked was Everspace. Because a lot of games, when they're in sort of development builds, there's NDAs involved. But for this one, they released the um, early release ver uh, versions of the game to people and said, please take screenshots, post them, stream it, post YouTube videos, whatever. All right, well, exactly what, Fall uh, what Bethesda did with Fallout 76. They were literally like, share it. <laughs> well, your oh, nice. is in Zaz really that great. immediately disproves that claim. If I make a guide of how to play Monster Hunter World and I sell it for money, I get to keep 100% of that money. But this isn't a guide. Right. But I, he said, if someone's making money off of it, I'm making money off of Monster Hunter World. 
it's a matter of, first off, as far as copyright goes, 70% of it must be changed. Not mm. only that, but if you make a textual guide, yeah, you, you're perfectly fine. But if you make a guide involving videos of the gameplay, what to do, then you're crossing a boundary. Yeah. Sort of. I would see that going to court, which is what I'm saying, is that a lot of this would be stuff that would have to be proven in court first, and no one wants to fight that battle. Like, if you if you had to spend 10 years in court defending a YouTube video, or you could take it down, which would you choose? Right Before now. or after I've gone, gone insane. <laughs> the problem here is that there is really there are really no laws that protect let's players because once it does go to court that means a law has to be made a decision <laughs> has to be made and that could go either in the favor of the publisher or in the favor of the uh let's players and the problem I think is you're thinking of precedent. It, it doesn't become law. It doesn't change the law itself until it goes to the Supreme Court. Uh, you're right. It's precedence. But yeah, it... but either way, that's still a precedence that it's a gamble on whether you're going to win because again, legally you don't have a leg to stand on with this. Sort not to mention of. the fact that you're not going to be able to fight against a big game company for that long. Unless you yeah. are a... There's a reason why companies don't touch the smaller streamers. It's, it's people like... like Or they don't I touch the big ones. Like PewDiePie or something. PewDiePie yeah, and... The people and have the money. These companies don't touch them because, well, those people could actually fight them. Yeah, and it's not that they don't have a leg to stand on. It would be ha they'd have to argue that a let's play is at least seventy, at least makes say a ch a trans transforms the product, meaning it's going to go to the opinion of the judge most likely, and game companies do not will absolutely not want that on like paper, so they'll settle out of court. And they'll usually probably settle out of court after demolishing you in court. Basically. Yeah. But we still don't have a legal... We have no legal right to be doing this. But you don't have any legal ill right. And no legal right is, is iffy. It's is what I'm not. saying the gray and that what what dreaming is not illegal but it's uh, making money off of it is legal when it comes down to it it's up to the individual companies that we have to respect their wishes with their product this is something mm -hmm. that capcom made and they have full legal ownership over it I can't claim this game as my... I can't claim footage of this game as my own. It's not your intellectual property. Uh, exactly. Yes, you, you can claim footage of this game as your own. Anyways, I, I'm done with this argument. It's going nowhere. In other uh, news, I just had some... A, a Kickstarter finally arrive. Treasure decks for D and D for stuff. D and D. Yeah. So you roll a number and you just pull that card and it has a list of what's there. Uh, it comes up with some more interesting treasure, which is what I liked about it. Is that it's not just okay. You find this many coins. I personally, when I'm playing D and D, prefer an item, something unique. Something that I can be like, yeah, I worked hard. I got this mug after I talked this dragon out of, you know, brutally killing us. 
Like my DM who gave me a shield of tear. Like. Like your what? Your DM did what? Gave me a shield of tear that can cast regeneration, and I'm a paladin. I don't learn regeneration ever. Yeah. <laughs> Instructions: Reward your players with loot by drawing a card from the deck and rolling a d12 to determine the treasure they find. It is up to the GM whether players draw their own cards or the GM draws for them. Magical items are marked by italic text in the parentheses, and players may require an appropriate check, such as arcana, history, or religion, to determine their nature, at the GM's discretion. Depending on the situation Second. or setting, draw one card or several. For example, looting a particularly tough goblin might yield one card, but finding the goblin's treasury might result in one card per player. To build a horde, keep drawing cards and rolling until the result is a 12. What the f? I'm gonna need a magnifying glass to uh, read this one. But it looks <laughs> like it's nothing but legalese. I'll, I'll put it up here for you guys to see. <laughs> it, it's a whole bunch of legalese that's just. Oh my god. Gosh, it's just it's squeezed into this card on front and back. Holy crap! <laughs> but anyways, like uh, the CR, their maximum one, which is what I happened to open first, uh, CR seventeen to twenty. First card, huh? Oh. What? No, I was thinking that card was the card. I was like, what? Oh no, it's a whole deck. There, There's a whole lot. Uh, there's a whole bunch of cards. It's just, then there's five total decks. One is for CR 1 to 4, then 5 to 8, 9 to 12, 13 to 16, and then 17 to 20. But like this one, uh, a platinum death mask inlaid with jewels and etched with gold, worth 10,000 gold pieces. Is this the one from Deck of Many Things? No, this is no, uh, no. from Nord something, Nord Games. I complained about them in uh, Discord a little bit ago. Because they, they, they were the Jack. ones that were... They were the ones where I sent them an email and got no reply, so I tweeted at them, and they're like, We're sorry to hear that. Please send us an email. Thanks, guys. But it's no, stuff like... you think I didn't do that first? It, it's stuff like these that are like... You've got a story from a platinum death mask, Lin laid with jewels and etched with gold. You don't have a story from the pile of 10,000 gold pieces. Uh, here, a large conch uh, shell made of gold with sapphire designs inlaid. Uh, they have a lot of magic items here. Oh, hey. A staff made of pure ice as hard as steel with two handles wrapped in leather and a piece of parchment folded into the shape of a diamond. Uh, that is a Staff of Frost and a ninth level spell scroll. It's stuff like this that I enjoy. When so. that spell call ends up being Wish. <laughs> now I gotta make, let my DMs know that these are available to them. I have to draw, but, you know. I wish they... They did... With their most recent Kickstarter, uh, they did give a PDF option with it that I'm getting as well. Unfortunately, the PDF was $10 extra, but you know. For 
worth it because you get the DM to option drawing it themselves. Exactly. Well, though, how, how do they draw a PDF page? Do they just type in a random page? Probably something like that. But that one was also objects of intrigue. Objects of interest. Um, so that one is more of a... You know, you're going to wind up with more... Uh, that's something that, honestly, I got because I enjoy the idea of interesting items that I could put into dungeons and such that I design. I'm getting dizzy. Why are you getting I'm dizzy? Running, I'm running circles on my pallet cone. It's actually making me dizzy. Uh, for the less, uh, for the less oh. valuable one, the uh, <laughs> CR one to four deck. You've got things like a charmed velvet kerchief, which will completely null any voice it covers for 30 seconds, once per week. Somebody is typing. I don't know who. Uh -huh. Not me. Uh, here's another one. A scimitar with a talon motif inscribed into the crossguard and hilt, and a shield resembling a pair of folded wings. It's... it's the shield of pigeon kind! And there's another one here that... it's simpler, but, you know, a small platinum coin worth seven gold pieces and five silver pieces, instead of a Damn, regular platinum. Pigeon. So it's a collector's coin. Sure. A pair of bone dice with flecks of gem for the pips. That'd be terrible. Okay. No, I meant like as dice. As in the, I'm pretty sure the pips are inlaid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're not sticking out, because that would not be good for rolling. <laughs> Two clay jars of scarlet fluid, which smells of cherries. That is two potions Mercy of healing. Cherries? They're two uh, potions of healing. I don't know if I'd drink a potion of healing if it tasted like Kool-Aid cherry. Sign me up. Honestly, I kind of imagine it's more of a you know, cough medicine that is supposed to taste like cherry, but tastes like, you know, uh, luck. Anyways. No, that sounds good. Enough distraction from the game. I am looking forward to using those in our D&D &D games. Oh gosh, I didn't check what treasure I earned. Uh... Uh, Cyrus, how much longer you got? Um, I can do one more if you want. Instead of another Nergigante, we should do Hellish Fiend Valhazak. Sounds good to me. <clears throat> I'll go with Central Camp. So, the thing I got from that thing is for armor, right? What thing? Uh, armor and a charge blade. Ah, okay. In a charge blade, you need the Anjanath gem and... Orgarin gem? It says it's alpha. Does that mean it has a zeta? There's Alpha and Beta. No, there's only Alpha. Oh. Oh, oh for those, yeah. It would have been nice I would if be they right back. had... It would have been nice if they all had a Zeta, at least. Or... That's I don't... temperate, though. Yeah. Why not? Just let all the event armors have, like, an ultimate form. <laughs> Can you imagine fighting those four as Arc Tempered? Is 
Like, no bueno. I don't think you have to get their specific arc tempered parts. I think you just need some arc tempered things. You need the Dante sword needs a red orb, two red orb, and and uh, gem, Odogaran gem, and four Chastermain. Hmm. Seven twenty attack power, one fifty thunder. Which is. Actually, equivalent to the first Nurgle, the Nurgle Lance Raider. Without, oh, that's. Hmm. Hope Sim enjoys fighting Zale Hazaki. Alright, I'm back. This is one that you have to join after I depart. Of course. Yep. Yeah, you have to actually fight the guy who's doing the thing. Although... The Dante Sword has a lot of blue sharps. Like, it's like a third of the bar. It's so much. Does it have an element? Thunder. 150 Thunder. Alright, departing. Be neat if one of the weapons you get is just a, a, a light bow and it's literally just a pistol. There's only one or I guess since it has to be cool, a magnum. You know what I imagine for like a Dead Rising here. link for this game? Um... For one, you could have that that um like Lego man help. No, that's um servo. I mean, servo sorry. helmet. Servbot. Yeah. Servbot, or... yeah. The servbot helmet. Um, you could also have a insect glaive that is the two chainsaws on the stick. And you can double blades, which are just boxing gloves with knives attached to it. Yeah. And the, for the event quest, if you cart, you get you get brought back by your palico pushing you in a shopping cart. You know, the name <laughs> of the quest is just going to be, I've covered wars, you know. <laughs> it would be. Man, poor, poor Frank and... Dead Rising 4. I think for Dead Rising 4, they should just pretend that game never happened. It was a dream. Yeah. Like, I'll defend 3. 3 was a misstep, but it was, like, a misstep anyone could have made. Because the idea of Dead Rising 3 is bigger is better. Well, like, instead of just it being a mall, it will be an entire city. And that sounds very good on paper. But then but, you won't go to half of the city. Well, go to a lot of the city, but the problem is, is now the city is the size of a city. So what parts do you get intimately familiar with? And how many survivors can you really save now? Because the city's so big, like, you'll never be able to, like, cover that much ground. And because there's more ground, it means instead of a time crunch, you could just spend all day waiting. And because it's a city and not a mall, so there isn't a lot of objects all bunched up. Hey, guys, get ready. Just... Okay. That means they just add Neon, objects. Neon, could you at... please let me... I'm gonna... See the. 
I don't know if there's talking or not. I like this Plague Doctor mask I've got. Did it just literally absorb all of their life? Yes. Yep. Empiric touch on a massive scale. Well, it, it can only do that. It can only do that with things that have enthusia. Oh, hey, I've got one of these. Yes, you do. This one. Essentially, it sucks the Apuvia virus right out from you, which I guess is like a recluse spider in that it turns your, like, muscles to jelly and then sucks out your muscles. Uh... You guys coming? Tally-ho! No, you can handle it. I'm running back through this. He's just gonna smash through that, isn't he? Yes, he is! Oh, fuck! That was not what I wanted to grab. Oh, he smashed through it and didn't go any further towards me. Okay! You guys have a little more time. What is all this? What is this water? Oh, that's, that's not good to... Yeah. I kind of like how this monster, more than any others, uses it, its abilities that, like, it has in kind of really smart ways. But other than that, the fight is not last, last, last. Yeah. Uh, generally, oh. he's the easiest of them. Well, I saw Cyrus run by, and Neon, and... And one of the three musketeers. Uh, he's the easiest unless you don't have the armor, in which case he's kind of the hardest because he has his breath attacks a one hit kill. It is not a one hit kill. If you don't have the armor, it's a one hit kill. Anyway. It's not a one hit kill even if you don't have the armor. Did they scale it down? It was never a one hit kill. One hit kill with me somehow. Yeah. It Maybe because you're. Your... It cuts your health in half, and if you hit after that, then you might die instantly. Oh no, I mean his br his guys. The breath laser? Yeah. Yeah, no, that's not a one to kill. I know it's not a one to kill, but I mean if your armor is really low, it will... Oh yeah, if your armor is... That's like the one situation where this guy actually... Seems like he is barely even together. No, he's not. He's he's pretty much the king. Uh, I don't think he himself is the king. I think he's wearing the decay remain decaying remains of other monsters. Welcome to the necromancer dragon. Uh oh. Mulberry. No. 
Maybe I should wear a fine bandit. I'm just slicing at his tail. But at least he's not very mobile. I can't remember. Doesn't he, like, not have a breakable tail? No, he can break break his tail. Uh, it just doesn't fall off? Or? Nah, it's no, it another falls off. I'm uh, probably thinking of another monster. Does anybody else? Just Thank you. Anyway, suffice it to say, if you're a game developer, figure isn't always better. He's coming down. Oh ho ho! I just spat really? a whole bunch of. Interesting if they wrote that like the whole you can't hurt each other was actually like real. Like they specifically make armor and the weapons so that like funny parts didn't happen. Yeah. Other than that, you actually hurt each other. Yeah, might as well eat the gyros. Thank you, Acid Resistance. I just slid through it fast enough it didn't hit me. I can barely see him past this mist. This is what's killing you. Yep, got him to drop his, uh... Heart. Oh. Got him. Yeah, the, the cool thing is, is he has a beam breath, but he's really smart with it, and if you start to surround him, he'll just shoot it straight at the ground, which creates essentially a wave. It, it's kind of a really smart way to use breath. I think it doesn't affect him at all. Remember earlier editions of Dungeons & Dragons, where uh, dragons actually, like, didn't have different breaths, they could just choose. I swore I had a few more Oh, I'm stunned. Oh, I'm out of sticky ammo. Oh, thank you, flying bug, flying creature thing. Yeah, those things are proving very annoying. Oh, it just kept hitting people being stunned. Normally they're annoying to me. Oh, just so you know, my insect dust is uh, healing. Heal. Yeah, see that? Oh, 
I forgot this whole time I could just jump on him. He's one of the monsters that are really good for it, too. Ah! Now, I thought it was, uh... Apparently I was just low enough not to get hit. Believe it or not, that beam goes way further than you think. Like, I don't even know if it, like, has a limit. Keeps keeping me up. It's the Wiggler. Never mind. <laughs> well, that one shot him. Really, one shot. I was already at like half health. Oh, he's running? Yep. Yep, he's at 25. Another good thing for I don't know if you can is fast recovery. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna sharpen because the Devil Joe blade does blunt fast. I think his armor is also good for fighting him. Hmm. I don't know, like a lot of monsters, their weapons and armor aren't good for fighting them. But Cyrus. are you guys here? Okay, you guys are here. Question, sir. She's used Mega Demon Drug and Mega Armor, uh, Armor Skin? Or regular ones? I prefer to use Megas. You use Megas then, that's what I'm asking. Megas or not. Because I determine whether I use mine to use buff everyone else. But if I use mine, I'll, I'll override yours. Well, I haven't buffed the Demon Drug. Assassin. Oh, hey, that's back up. Oh. No! <laughs> Damn it, he went out of range. Bringing him to the ground. Or not. Try again. There. Bringing him right. to the ground at a moment, then. <laughs> <laughs> Just taking my time. He doesn't seem to want to. There Whoa. we go. Fiber ammo.
I don't have a fluvia, so it doesn't affect me. And now I do. That was my last snowberry, by the way. Oh, I have tons. Have a small. Oh no! Oh, oh shit! Bro, saying, "Oh, this is the easiest one of the three. This is one of the three. <laughs> well, you just have to learn him, and he's probably the one who punishes less aggressive styles the most out of the three. Like, Diora punishes aggressiveness, and he punishes unaggressiveness, so to speak. Kind of not, but that... I know why. I, I kept getting Fluvia. I didn't have my Fluvia resistance gems on. <laughs> Hey, well, some street. of my Anjanath weapons or armor can be made. When did I get the resources for that? Must have been during place. that, uh, yeah. I didn't see it say that I got any pelts for whatever you missing. Mm. Oh. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna question it, I'm just gonna get it. Do you think if they make another Monster Hunter stories and it has Toby Kadachi that Zim will just buy it? Hmm. Yes. Yeah. He'll bring it to the last boss even though it, it's supposed to be a subpar monster. What do you mean last boss? Uh... In Monster Hunter stories, you tame uh, monsters from Monster Hunter and ride them into battle. I want this. <laughs> I want this now. It's on the 3DS. No, I want one with the Toby Kadachi. Yeah, no, it doesn't exist yet. I will shoot you. Hey, I want <laughs> a monster hunter for nothing. Yeah, I want a monster hunter stories too a lot. So I'll be happy once they I just have want a monster hunter hunt monster hunter game that has all the monsters. Even like the ones that are just like slight alterations of already existing Bye. monsters. Uh, sure. Here, here's Kutku. Here's Kutku, except he's white. Here's Kutku, except he's pink. Here's Kutku, except he's green. Looking at you, Generations Ultimate. Oh, now I'm out of pelts. I like the Kezu, but I I mostly just love the Kezu armor. It he, like I have to hand it to Kezu. He knows how to. Form his body into good armor. Okay, I have my hunting horn that 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 does blight resistance increase. So, Fluvia will be a less of an issue. Alright, Anjaneth Van Braces. Set decoration. And it literally can get rid of Fluvia. Oh, I can put one of these on here. Okay. I really should just get immunity to the Fluvia, but. Uh... I have it for my charms. I think the only way to get, like, true immunity is to get max out the resistance, not the immunity. Am I correct? I believe so, because you're immune to effluvia. Friend to effluvial buildup.
Yeah, what do I need to even get that? My asthma jewels. The skill is called effluvial fluvial resistance. Well, let me see what I have on my thing. A vitality jewel, a scent jewel. Why? Some of these I think I only have because I just so don't. Have them? Yeah, because I think I don't have much else. Like, one of them is just resuscitate. Yeah, you Actually, yeah. Resuscitate is really good against certain bosses. Yeah. If, if you don't have, like, fire immunity against certain bosses it's just like oh yay so I, I get super dodges until all right well i've got yeah, my man. asthma protection too can you go for it again uh cyrus yeah bah hazak gives a few resistance i like bah hazak's armor all right, it is posted. And you guys can like join in, before we leave. In the lake. Like, I hear it's not very good, but oh, I just like the idea of regenerating forever. Oh, the increased health regen? Uh, no, no, uh, his set bonus. Oh, yeah, you can you can regen past, past the red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but I hear that ability's not that good. My guess is it probably is really slow. Do I want defense really up? Slow. And uh, yes, defense up. Once you get... We haven't left yet. And you, you know what they say. Make sure you fight a monster 30 minutes after eating. <laughs> so you're gonna fight it 2 minutes after eating. Yeah, just... I just ate. Oh yeah, whatever. Depart. Another aspect I guess Zim would like about Monster Hunter stories if they come out with a extra version is that he'll be able to make new elemental versions of Toby Kadachi. If he wants a water Toby Kadachi, he can totally do it. They're never going to make oh, a sequel. Oh, water Kadachi? Yes, so well, sure. You can do Aqua it with... Tadachi. Yeah, you can do it with Aqua any Dachi. element, so technically. You can make a dragon Toby Kadachi. Hmm. Yeah, unfortunately... As, yeah, unfortunately, as awesome as that idea is, most... It's usually just better to stick with their right original. The yeah. Because they get, like, some inherent bonuses to their inherent element. I would still enjoy it. It's so true. Good. Zim would have a team of all Tobys, and they'd all be different elements. Yes. It, it'd be it'd be an ev evolution team. I am okay with this. I mean, come on, guys. I begged the DM oh for God. the Monday group to let me have freaking <laughs> have a Toby Kadachi. I have plans to uh, uh, to alter him and stuff. He's gonna have. I lots still remember of cool our stuff. instance in in uh, the D and D where we had a levitating ferret. Oh yes, uh, let's not forget the uh, gecko on a string, uh, or on it, with a ring of, uh, what is, okay. Oh, this gives earplugs? Hell yeah! Oh, I must have de-equipped my full of Fluvio defense. <clears throat> yeah, I had a, uh, in one of our previous games, we had a ring of Featherfall that we put around the middle of a gecko. We tied the ring to a string 
And basically, we just had a floating gecko. Because it was constantly in a state of slowly falling. And it was great. I don't know where I am, but I'm just following where the scout cars are pointing me. Hey, it works! What work? Are you guys fighting it already? Yes. Yeah. Oh. I didn't know what... <laughs> yeah, it's stuff like that that makes you uh, need to start D &D fantastic. So I'm hit. Ow. It's always those things where I kind of wonder how it's kind of like on the viewer side, because, like, this epic battle's happening and it's, you're not even there. I didn't even know you guys had engaged it already. Stop doing that! I stopped him. Really like the idea of this boss monster. I even made like a version of him for fifth edition. Okay, I'm going to die very quickly. Yeah. The problem I kind of bumped into is that there's so much immunity to disease in 5th edition that I had to just invent that he could disease people immune to disease, but they are resistant to the damage he produces or something like that. They, we are immune to blight. We a pair of times. But I meant in Dungeons and Dragons, there are so many people immune to disease, it would make you immune to this effluvia. I mean, there's really not that many. I think there's the Druid and the Paladin. Yeah. yeah. That's it. Uh, and the Monk. Oh yes, and the Yeah, why do you use your your blight your no barriers? You know I have wide range. And I, I keep an eye on that stuff. I keep an eye on it. The monk is a very oftenly overlooked uh, class. It's ridiculously overpowered. It really uh, is. In fifth edition, honestly, people would stop bad mouthing the monk if like wizards were a lot more common. Because the monk is like in fifth edition, the monk is practically an anti-wizard. But fifth edition hates to send casters of any sort after you. I mean, like wizard flings. I don't believe that to be true at all. That's not at all true. It all depends on your DM. No, I'm aware of that, but I'm referring to, like, adventure paths and monsters that are currently written. I still don't believe that. I ran Adventures League for quite a while, and there were plenty of wizards. Adventures League is not, like, Wizards of the Coast, though. Yes, it is. It is? Yes. Hmm. To run it, you tech you need a certification from Wizards of the Coast. Granted, that certification is hell is incredibly easy to get, but they still technically require it. Nine 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 nine. Sorry. German there for some reason. It's okay. 
Just don't let it happen again. Ow! Cease and desist! Ha! I dodged it, you bastard! Because we hate listening it so, so much, we deafen ourselves. Sorry, bad joke. I mean, no, it's just my, my, my playing is so bad that this deafens you. Actually, I strongly believe that if someone has full earplugs, they should not be affected by a hunting horn. Like, the buff should not happen. I wasn't aware that there were. Are there act? Are you talking about actual earplugs in the game? Incoming! No, it's a skill. It makes it makes you ignore the roars. Potion going down the. Oh, thank you. I am the bard. I actually love the bard too. Yeah. The one, the one class I kind of wanted to come back for fifth edition was the warlords. But I can understand why they didn't bring it back. There were quite a few of the extra classes that were absolutely overpowered. No, 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 get me out of... Oh crap, I'm in the acid, and I'm stunned. No! No! Oh good. He's running. Guys, I'm gonna drop a life powder thing. I was committed to my song playing. <laughs> Gosh, you should just see like how awesome the horn is in Monster Hunter stories. I guess that didn't beginning. do what I thought it did. It, its theme is that in order to use its special abilities, you have to actually like do different attacks. <sighs> so it has to. Like... Yes, Sim. Sorry, that was just a near death experience. Yeah, Sim got really close to dying there. I was like, oh no, I've committed to playing my horn. I can't. I can't cancel. I, I was stunned. Almost out of health, and I got knocked into the acid. Yeah, but it ran away because it knew if it killed you, it's dead. I don't think it really cares about uh, killing me. Uh, in fact, I'm pretty sure it would be fine with killing me. I like the Magus, I just don't think they really pulled the Magus... I don't like how they pulled the Magus off exactly. No, there's no way they're going to let oh, the Magus... Oh, Cyrus is Yeah? I no... oh. I've never played Pathfinder myself. It's never been something that interests me. A, a good way to put what the Magus is, is he's a touch wizard. He fights by touching people. And 
then he can enhance his sword. Oh, so the uh, war mage. Yeah, he's kind of like how the war mage. I went with the Spellblade in the Monday D&D because uh, I like that idea. Oh, I'd love to see an image they release of Valhazak and, like, what he looks like without any of the dead flesh in order. Boosh! He'd was... probably look like a black dragon. Incoming! Of course he would run. Well, he was trying to run for a while there. He knows we if didn't he let him. He knows if he dies too quickly, your stream will be over. <laughs> He's only thinking of our viewers, Zim. Yeah. Thank you, Val, for, for being for so concerned of our viewership. I mean, once no, this game's we... over, I'm planning to move to uh, Pokemon Let's Go, so... Incoming! And once that Pokemon fan game's done, you'll probably not play it, but maybe you will. Uh, all depends on his popularity. Uh... I doubt it will gain as much popularity as Insurgents did when it released. Fact is, is that I've got to focus on those that are popular. As much as I'd love to be able to play whatever game I want, I play games that are fun, but that are popular enough to actually have people come watch them. Because, you know, there's no point in streaming if nobody's going to watch you do it. It's literally so the entire so point of streaming. so popular that it doesn't matter, but you have to reach, like, a certain threshold to manage that. One day I will be there. Where is my spreading? There it is. I think for that, you need at least 10 million subscribers or something like that. No. How much do you estimate, then? I'd say 100, uh, 100 subscribers to the channel, and I will be able to do whatever. At least a day of whatever. Oh, I dodged right at the right time. First aid. And he faces me! Thank you, Demouser. Man. You know, there's something cruel about watching a monster, like, watching an animal just limp away, and we're like, He's limping! Kill it! I Kill mean, when down. the animal is this thing, I don't think anybody would have sympathy for it. Hey, did you know that if you shoot an animal and you don't kill it, you're actually obligated to hunt it down and kill it because an injured animal is dangerous? Yes. Or if you run into it with your vehicle. And not only because it's dangerous, but because that's just a simple... It's cruelty. Yeah, it's a mercy you survive to that. There, there are some animals that if you run into them, there's a better chance you're dead than them. Oh, oh yeah. Goose? Deer as well. We got so lucky, my grandparents and I. We had a deer hit us, and my grandpa handled it like a champ. He just took its neck, snapped it so hard that you had a man to lose. Now, uh... no. 
I just remember it was early morning. Uh, we were driving to from Ohio down to North Carolina, and he uh, just out of the blue there was the deer, and uh, he hit it. The van was really just really messed up, uh, but he. He handled it very well. You kind of need if this monster had like random monsters beside him for the sole purpose of just like eating. Yeah. You mean like the gyros mm -hmm. that are all over the place here? Yeah, you know, those are just distractions. They're not there to serve as like extra batteries. Wow, you can barely see him amongst all this. Where is your tail? There is your tail. Boop. Boop. It's kind of interesting that he kind of has camouflage. Also, bones over here. I am out of wyvern and cluster bombs. Then I will whack it with my horn. Okay, I put the bombs down. Oh, there's another bomb pile? Oh, nice. Doesn't he regain health doing this? Not very quickly. There is one monster, and I think it's the Bedema, and his theme is he actually regenerates health all the time. But that's because he doesn't sleep, if I remember correctly. It's not to make it challenging. He also nukes the whole world. Yes, thank you for facing me for this. Ow! Huh. I didn't know you could add more acid to the world. I still have a little bit of this left. Is it bad? No. It's faking it! Aha! Now it's dead. No, oh, maybe it is decaying itself. I always thought it was just dressed in rotten flesh. Like, as camouflage. Stop pushing me around, I'm trying to carve. Damn it, Jules. Oh, I didn't finish uh, carving him. Yeah, you get four carves from elders. Well, I thought I had been done, but I got it was because I got pushed around. Also, if you want extra Giros to carve, I have you covered, I guess. You can carve them in, in five seconds. Shit! <laughs> I got one carving. I didn't. I went with the, uh, bone pile instead. Oh, I didn't know I could get commissions off this. Yeah, you get high you get high camp combinations off every single auto dragon. Yeah. Hey, Hunter Rake 15! Yay, I cost the most ailment. Oh wait, I have the exploding weapon that counts as an ailment. I got oh, gathering maniac. Ha <laughs> 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 don't you? Rodeo. Hey, Big Mac, good to see you! 159 buffs applied. Hunting horn is not. I don't care about what you've got to say, Navi. Ha ha! I'm back with a vengeance! And right on time! 
My time, anyway. So, I hear you get to take credit for all of the Delta Dragons. Not bad, not bad. <laughs> I always knew you'd wreck shop. That's why the commander and I handpicked hand you in the first place. But I've got a little news to share myself. Remember how I said my old friend told me that he was going to track down a certain place brimming with energy? Well, he found it. He found it big time. So I was thinking about checking it out myself. Chances are it will explain why the Elder Dragons have all started going bonkers. Hmm. Oh, and my friend has a message for you. I promised our paths would cross again, and so they must. I shall not take the boat until you get here. All right. Hear that? It's a personal invitation! Which means you're coming along. No ifs, ands, or kungalala butts? Okay. It's a, a, it's a monster of the game. Yeah, he shoots flaming farts at you. I'll let your handler figure out the rendezvous and rendezvous. Got to make it an official quest and all that. Now, don't go spilling the beans to the others. This is just between us. Okay. Oh, sorry, guys. I wasn't supposed to tell you all. All you have to do is sign up for the quest and show up. And don't be late. Absolutely nothing will happen. I swear. Oh, my Impressive. God, no. Fine work taking care of those Elder Dragons. With everything that's transpired, we should send word to the guild immediately. I'll have the captain ready a ship. However, it's still unclear why the Elder Dragons returned to the Elder's Recess. It's almost like they were drawn to it. Well, we'll just have to continue our research until we find the answer. Either way, I'll start compiling the information and... What's wrong? Hmm? Something on your mind? The Admiral's been making plans again, has he? Where's that old devil going this time? Wherever it is, I suppose now you're going to. You and your partner, huh? Understood. Well, all right. I'll handle things here. Just remember that whatever happens, your partner will always be there at your side to help you. And we'll be here, too, waiting for you. Find what there is to find, but then promise you'll find your way back home. All right. How do you feel hey, now that you did you sure everyone else's job? About the same as before. What else is new? I, I just love Teostra's the funniest one. I hate that you have to exit out of the Tail of Raider Safari thing and then go back in. Yeah. Cyrus and in Senudususum. You are the one that. Uh -huh. I'm sending out your. Palicos on a very, very special quest. I see. Alright, uh, okay, just to. to to tell people specifically what Kongala is, it's a gorilla hippo with deadly artillery farts. <laughs> I posted a picture of the media sharing. Yeah. Hey, partner. And it has sure two, go on that and it has an Admiral? alternate form, and I think that alternate form's pink or it's green. Can't remember. How wonderful. I believe it's green. No, it's pink, and depending on whatever mushroom it eats, it has that effect for its fart. Yeah. I've completed quite a few bounties. All except for one of my bounties. Ah, uh, the list of 3DS games I wish would get a sequel, like Dragon Ball Fusions. 
Alright guys, well, that is it for Monster Hunter World. Do stick no. around because, as I said, I will be moving on to Pokemon Let's What's Go. What's the bright boy? What? I'll have to wait till next week for whatever. No. Yep. No. Okay. Anyways, everybody, thank you so much for but joining. You're, just... you're like the one quest away from unlocking the rest of the game. Well, we'll get to it next week. Ah. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for joining this evening. I will be back in just a few minutes with um, Pokemon Let's Go, so do stick around for that. Thank you to my patrons, donators, and subscribers. You guys are the ones that make sure I can keep bringing you this content. And otherwise, yeah, thank you very much for joining. And I bid you all adieu. I'll be back in a moment. Bye. Have a nice time. Bye. Good night.